good local Malaysian players. I think in Penang FC, we've got many young uh, up-and-coming players um, who, who have all shown like they've got a lot of talent and just need that experience in game time to um, keep developing and keep improving. Hai, Assalamualaikum semua. Selamat datang kepada follower page Harimau Melayu. Hari ini eksklusif saya bawakan untuk anda sekali lagi. Kita bersama dengan import baru daripada Penang FC iaitu Dylan Wenzel Hall. How are you Dylan? Is it good for you? I'm good, thank you. Thank you for having me. I really appreciate it. Yeah, uh, thank you too. Uh, appreciate it for your time. So, my first question is, uh, after three games, you play with Penang. How so far you feel about the game, about the environment and about the culture here? Yeah, so far, obviously, uh, I played my third game yesterday and I'm really enjoying my my time in Malaysia and, and specifically with um, Penang FC, I think. Um, you know, we're a little bit disappointed with the, how the, the results have gone. You know, we've we've drawn one and lost two. So, of course, this is disappointing, but there's been there's been plenty of positives that we can take out of these performances. And, um, yeah, so far, look, I, I'm just enjoying myself here and, and trying, trying to do my best for Penang. So, after three games, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is you one goal, one assist, right? Yes. So, you're satisfied with your performance after three games? I think, um, of course, you know, I'm happy to contribute with a goal and happy to contribute with an assist. But I think the the important thing is 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 it's a results based industry. So you know, we haven't got the results that we've been after as a team. Um, but as an individual, of course, I'm happy to score and happy to assist. Um, so early in my time in in the Malaysian Super League, I think uh, that is important also. So um, yeah, look, I can always improve, and I'm I'm always striving to be better. But um, you know, so far. Um, I'm happy with my performances and, and I, I do believe I will get better also. Right. So before this, you play for Central Coast Mariner and the champion of AS, AFC Cup last season. So at the first point, what, what's the main reason you come to play for Penang? Well, for starters, obviously, you know, I had a successful season last year with Central Coast Mariners and I probably didn't get to play as much football as I would have liked, obviously, um, you know, being the A-League champions and then AFC Cup champions, it makes it very difficult to to break into the team. But um, this opportunity come up to join Penang and I've always wanted to test myself in uh, you know, overseas and uh, um, play in a different country other than Australia. And, you know, when this opportunity come up, it was uh, an easy decision for me to, to join Penang. Penang is a, a beautiful city. It's, a, it's an amazing place and um, I'm really enjoying my time here so far. And the Malaysian Super League is a, is a very good league. Again, I'm enjoying my time playing in the Malaysian Super League. It's it's different to Australia, you know. Every league is different, but so far I'm enjoying my time here, and um, yeah, it's been good. Before you accept the offer from Penang, do you know about Penang and Malaysia culture, Malaysia league? Yeah, uh, I've been to Malaysia last season. We played against Terengganu in the, the yeah. AFC Cup, so obviously I got to see um, a little glimpse of what Malaysian football is like, and um, you know, see a little bit of Malaysia. Um, so. Yeah, look, I did a little bit of research on Penang and, you know, I found it was a, a good suit and a good club for me to join. And um, and I'm really enjoying the culture in Malaysia. The, the food is, is very good. The the people are very uh, welcoming and, and, and very uh, generous towards me. And I'm just happy to be here. So you play for the Australian League, uh, Malaysia League. So after three games, what do you think the difference between uh, both leagues? I think it's very different. Obviously, in Australia, you know, there's there's many big stadiums and, um, you know, the fields are very good. And, um, of course, it's very hot in Australia, but I think Malaysia is a different kind of heat. It's uh, it's very humid and, and very warm here. But in terms of the league, obviously, um, I like the, the competitiveness of the, the Malaysian Super League. And I think, um, you know, it's a very strong league. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm just, you know, very happy to be playing in it and, and continue to, to build on, on what we've started. So uh, I want to ask a question. What do you think about the coach Akmariza, right? So this uh, Akmariza is one of the legend in football in Malaysia. So it's a good prospect for young coach. How so far you work with Akmariza? Yes, he's been fantastic. Obviously, um, he he's done a fantastic job so far, and um, I've heard a lot of uh, a lot of good things about uh, Coach Akmal um, from his playing time, and you know he had a very good career in in Malaysia and also overseas. So. Um, for an ex-professional player to, to take an opportunity into coaching, I think is fantastic to give back to, you know, the, the new generation of players and share his experiences with, with us players. Um, you know, he knows Malaysian football very well. So um, he's been very good to work with so far. And, and yeah, it, it's been a pleasure. Uh, I just want to uh, ask you about your opinion. Eh? Uh, after your observation, uh, after three games, you play in Malaysia League. 
do you think that the Malaysia local player have a chance uh, to play abroad one day? Of course, I think there's lots of good, um, good local Malaysian players. I think in Penang FC, we've got many young uh, up-and-coming players um, who, who have all shown like they've got a lot of talent and just need that experience in game time to um, keep developing and keep improving. But across the league, obviously, there's, you know, there's very um, large amounts of strong you know, local players. And it's so good to see. I think, I think um, for a long time, um, Southeast Asian countries have been developing and, and getting stronger and stronger. And I think this is why uh, Southeast Asia are now competing very strongly in um, world football. You know, the, they've been getting some good results uh, across Asia. So it's, um, it's good to see. Okay, so my second last question is, uh, what's your target and your hope for Penang this season with you? Personally, I want to score um, and assist and, and uh, as many goals as I can to help the team. And I think doing that will obviously um, hopefully end up winning games also. So I think the biggest target for us is to, to turn these draws and these losses into, into wins and, and move up the ladder and, and you know, keep climbing the ladder and um, giving our fans something to be happy about. And um, I think we can definitely do that. Uh, individually, you know, I want to have a good season. I want to um, show the fans of Penang and Malaysian football what I can do. And I want to score and, and assist and contribute to my team that way. So maybe your last word for your fans and Penang fans that always support you after three games. I just want to say, obviously, I've only been here for three games and I think the results haven't been uh, as good as we would have liked. But I think it's important that the fans keep believing in us and keep supporting because we are giving our, our all for, the, for, for Penang and, and for the, the, the jersey and um, we're trying our best. Um, and and this, is, this is football and this is professional sport. Um, you can give your absolute best and sometimes results don't go your way. And sometimes they do go your way. And I think um, our luck will change and, and we will start to see results go our way and just keep believing in the players and, and the coaching staff because, you know, we're all working so very hard and, uh, and we're, we're always giving our all for, for Penang FC. So um, we'll continue to do this. And um, we've got three weeks now before the next game against uh, Pahang. So uh, we've got a lot of work to do and um, we're going to keep improving these next couple of weeks to uh, put in a good performance at our home stadium against Pahang. All right, Dylan, thank you for your time. I really appreciate it. So I wish you all the best. Have a, wish you a, have a good season in Malaysia and Penang. So hope to see you soon. Thank you. I really appreciate your time and um, thank you for having me on your show. I really appreciate it. All right, thank you, Dylan. All the best. Thank you. Uh, terima kasih. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you.